This is how to refinance your car loan the right way with a guy who works in finance. Most lenders allow you to refinance your loan without penalties before you even make the first payment. They just don't advertise it because they want to keep your business. I see all too often where people get themselves into a car loan that just doesn't make sense. High interest rates, long terms, financing with a bank they end up hating, you name it, I've seen it. It leaves a ton of people stuck and not knowing what to do. But that's why you follow me because you know I've got you covered. Step one, get a rough idea of how much your car is worth. You have to make sure you don't owe more on your car than it's worth. Most lenders will only finance between 90 and 110% of the car's value. Some lenders go as high as 125%, but that's not common. Step two, obtain your 14 to 21 day payoff with your current lender. Auto loans accrue interest on a daily basis, and your new lender will need a future dated payoff to make sure that when they send their payoff, it covers the entire loan balance. If the loan balance isn't fully paid off with the old lender, they will not release the title for the new lender to add their lien, which will cause a lot of problems down the road for you. Step three, get approved with a lender and then shop the rate around. Most banks and credit unions have refi programs, so you wanna make sure you're getting the best deal. Bonus tip, don't extend your loan term. If you have three to four years left to pay off your loan and you bump that up to a 60 to 72 month term, your monthly payment might go down, but unless the interest rate is drastically lower, you're defeating the purpose of the refi. You're supposed to be doing this to save money. So don't be silly and make sure you refinance the right way and follow for more.